Hi guys and welcome back to another Asphalt 8 video where I will be unlocking a couple of cars I didn't have because, you know, I didn't use to go for all the cars a few months back. Now I go for all of them because, you know, we have ultimate upgrades and that stuff. But back then I didn't use to go for all the cars either because they weren't kings or because their performance wasn't the best one. So today I will be unlocking a couple of them with these uh, S-Class Master keys because I had like three from offers and gave of compensations because of the nerfs and that stuff. So I decided to use at least a couple of them in order to lock uh, two cards that I really wanted to have for a long time, mostly because I want to reach uh, the total amount of 350 cards on my garage and I'm quite close. That's why I decided to go for a uh, these cars because well they are far from being the best cars around its rank but it's nice to have them so that's why i decided to go for them the first one was the bugatti chiron 300 uh, ans special edition it's like the chiron special edition be, but because basically it's the exact same car as the normal bugatti chiron and also the koenigsegg gemera because well i really like koenigsegg as a brand overall and the gemera isn't that bad either so well was a nice investment of that s-class master key and also i was thinking like okay now i have both of the cars i wanted to get but it will take me days maybe weeks, even months of converting uh, wild cards in order to have all the pro kits, 20 million fusion coins because they are S-class cards and they are extremely expensive to upgrade. So I decided to use an ultimate upgrade on each one of them because that was like the easiest way to have them fully upgraded in a matter of seconds. So there I go and I use actually two of my ultimate upgrades. I have like eight ultimate upgrades or so, so still I have a really nice stock of uh, ultimate agris on my inventory and uh, still I was thinking maybe I need to upgrade another car because you know I have a lot of S-class cars but I don't have all of them fully upgraded so after upgrading this Koenigsegg Gemera I had a look at my S-class garage and I decided to of course upgrade another car I was uh, thinking on for a very long time because you know I don't have a lot of options left I have the Masanti Evandra, which wasn't like the very best option. The Torino isn't like the very best option either. The Valhalla is pure trash, but I had the Aspark all slightly upgraded. So I thought I thought that would be a nice idea to fully upgrade this car because it's a quite old festival car. I mean, this car is at least a couple of years old. So I thought to myself, well, maybe it's actually worth to go for, so that's why I'm doing. I And of course, I will be using a few of my S-Class uh, final upgrades in this case, because of course, this car was already upgraded a bit, so it wasn't worth to use an ultimate upgrade, because otherwise, all the resources I have spent previously on this car will be thrown to, to the rubbish bin. So I thought that would be a better idea to use my final upgrades on this car. So now, on my garage, I have the uh, Conise Gemera, the Bugatti Chiron Special Edition, and now the Aspark Owl Fuel Upgraded, which I will be trying maybe on a live stream or something like that, because these cars are, are like not the very best, are quite interesting on multiplayer, but are not insane overall. Maybe, you know, maybe in the future I will need them on some kind of event, I'm not sure, but at least now I have them fuel Upgraded, because another goal I was pursuing was to actually own 300 uh, vehicles on my garage, fully upgraded, and I'm close to that goal actually. So that's why I thought that with these uh, purchases, the, the purchases I made today, I was close, closer than ever to that goal. So, well, that was pretty much it. I really hope you all enjoyed this video. I will try to keep try, uh, testing the new uh, performance card we got after this update. And of course, these were my new acquisitions. I really hope you all enjoyed this video. Let me know your thoughts, drop your like, and I will see you really soon with much more Asphalt 8.